Let's stick those of you right here. Until someone chooses you. The Reese's Peanut Butter Cups. Old Man Lloyd's favorite. Mr. Goodbar. What a classic. Let's put you right here. Ah, cookies and cream. I have not tried you yet. I got so caught up in making everything perfect that I did not see you there. Um, I hope you weren't waiting long. Well, that is very good to hear. Um, First off, start by, how are you doing today? Excellent. Ah, in need for some tasty, sweet treats. Well, I think we can help you with that. Have you, um... Taking a, a bit of a gander around our store. Okay. Ah. Uh, not sure exactly what you're looking for. Well, I think we can also help you with that. Um, yes. We are a division of Lloyd's Candy Shop. Um, this is Lloyd's Discount Suite. Um, kind of sounds strange. Yeah. Um, well, what happens is 
over at Lloyd's Candy Shop, whatever becomes old stock comes over here and gets sold at a discount price. It is kind of nice, isn't it? That way it, you know, gives our customers a chance to save a little money, but also fulfill those taste buds looking for a, a sweet treat. Even if you have the time, um, I'd like to show you some of the delicious candies we have here. Maybe even persuade you on a few. That is if you have the time. I, I don't want to you know, take up your whole day. That's fine. Wonderful. Well, let me start by asking you what kind of sweets, candies, that you typically enjoy. As you can tell by what's on the shelf behind me and throughout our little pop-up shop, we have quite a variety. So I'd like to um, pinpoint your, your interests your particular taste. Okay. You enjoy chocolate. Now, do you enjoy milk chocolate, white chocolate, or both? Okay. Well, that makes it a little easier. And what else are some of your normal sweets that you go to? Gummies. Okay. Cotton candy. No. We have a few varieties of cotton candy. Okay, well, um, let me show you some of our more unusual candies. Some of our more unique flavors, if you'd like to try them, that is. Oh, yes, yes. Um, what you see behind me is our sampling station. We have one at the regular candy shop as well. You let me choose. Very well. Now what to start off with first? Well, you said you enjoyed chocolate. And I have quite a variety of chocolate bars. Have you ever tried Kit Kats before? You have. All right. Well, I've got one here that 
I'll bet you never tried. And that is the birthday cake flavored Kit Kats. Um, it's a white chocolate, crispy wafer with a vanilla flavored cream and birthday cake sprinkles. Now, I have personally tried these before and they are quite exquisite. Let's try them. I want to see if this is something you'd be interested in. Let me just pull out a pair of scissors. smells just like a birthday cake. Here, smell for yourself. Doesn't it though? It's amazing how they get all these delicious flavors into these candies. Here. I always enjoy uh, trying these candies with customers. You know, it helps. Um, it helps me explain the flavors, the textures, and so on to the customer. Enjoy. As you said, when, when you're chewing it up and everything's, you know, moving about, you can really taste those flavors just swirling around. It really does taste like a birthday cake. How do you feel about these? Is this something that um, you could see yourself buying? I kind of thought so. Well, we have plenty more 
where this came from. Let's try another one. I'm sure you've had your enjoy the cookies and cream flavor, then I think you'll enjoy this. Now, it's uh, a white chocolate that kind of tastes like the cream part of an Oreo cookie. But then, it also has tiny little cookie crunches in amongst the bar. Kind of looks like this. So, you get the best of both worlds with the flavors. The cream and the just swirling around, mixing together. It's just like eating an Oreo cookie. Wouldn't you agree? It 
It's quite delicious. And have you noticed how the white chocolate tastes more like the Oreo cream filling than actual white chocolate? Mm -hmm. It's very good. Which one to try next? Well, I show you our Hershey's, our Reese's, such and so forth. And of course we have our, our Heath bars and our Mr. Good bars. Um, Baby Ruth. Because not only do you get the milk chocolate, the nougat, caramel, but you also get peanuts. It's almost like a Snickers, but slight differences, but not by much. So have our Twix bars, um, delicious cookie crunch with caramel, milk chocolate. Now, are you a right or left Twix bar type of person? You remember the old commercials? Yeah. Anyway. Have you ever tried a bueno? Crispy, creamy chocolate bar. This thing practically melts in your mouth. And it is so creamy and delicious. You have to try this. So, a little bit about this chocolate bar. Um, it's a crispy wafer with a creamy hazelnut filling coated in a delicious creamy milk chocolate. Um, you're not allergic to hazelnuts or anything. Okay. I just thought I'd uh, check before we start enjoying this chocolate bar. Oh, we are very welcome. We always look out for our customers. Our customers truly do come first. I beg your pardon. Do I always keep my scissors in my pants? Um, yeah, I 
really haven't had any um, accidents or anything. Um, I just, you know, kind of got used to it. So, but thank you for looking out for me, as I did for you. Ah, smells delicious. Go ahead and uh, grab yourself a piece. All right. And I am definitely going to have a piece of this. These are amazing. Bon appetit. Yeah. 
be hot dogs. And again, I'm not 100% sure on the flavor. Um, me personally, I think it would probably taste really, really horrible if it legitimately tastes like hot dogs. But, to each their own. Now, you said you enjoy cotton candy. as nervous as you are. smells like kind of smells like cinnaburst chewing gum doesn't it though yeah well go ahead and grab yourself some really not that bad. It does. It does taste just like that Cinnabur's chewing gum. It's actually pretty amazing. Would you like another one? Take as much. 
Okay. 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 said before, some specialty 
candies can kind of have a real dull taste or a real chemical taste to them. And that could apply to these. But on the other hand, they could be quite delicious. You know, there's only one way to find out. But I'll let that up to you. Now. I have something here. That. Is actually kind of new. These are candy gels. That's right. I've never seen these before. Um, he said that he, he ordered them without knowing what exactly they were. He said they sounded interesting. And I kind of have to agree. But it's called Slurpers. Sour green apple. And sour strawberry. Would you be interested in trying these with me? Okay. Let me grab a couple spoons. And we'll try them out. Let's try the sour green apple first. I don't smell anything. And grab you a spoon. you think? Okay. Yeah, I, I think it has a, a hint of sour. It's not really a overpowering sourness. It's more, more of an equal And the green apple flavoring is actually quite good. Yeah, it is actually uh, pretty delicious. Well, let's try the strawberry one. All right. Grab you a spoon.
and here you are. And now for me. What do you think about this woman? It's kind of different, isn't it? Mm -hmm. Yeah, I agree. It's almost thicker than the green apple. With a bit more sourness to it. And I think as for the strawberry flavor. The strawberry really has a chemical taste to it. And an aftertaste that kind of tastes like you shouldn't be eating it. Almost like poison. I'm not a fan of that one either. Well, let's find something that will help get that taste out of our mouth. You said you enjoyed gummies, right? Okay. Well, I have some gummies that I'd like you to try. Right here. It's the sweet, not sour, not so sour punch sweet bites with green berry, passion punch, grateful grape, and cotton candy. Let's try these out. I'm interested to see what these taste like. has a a semi sweet flavor. I'm 
It's not you know, overpoweringly sweet. That's for the berry flavor. Um, did you get anything out of that? Yeah, me neither. Well, let's try the next one, shall we? Um, let's go with Passion Punch, which is the red one. Are you tasting what I'm tasting? It's almost like, like sour milk. You taste that, right? I'm not the only one. Well, Passion Punch was horrible. Let's try the grape. The grape's actually pretty good. <laughs> we both agreed on that one. <laughs> well, we have one more. Do you even get any flavor at all? Yeah, me neither. Well, these were highly disappointing, to say the least. Some fond memories of 
indulging in some pop rocks. Me too. I have two different types here. I have Warheads Sour Popping Candy, which has the flavors of green apple, watermelon, and blue raspberry. And I have the original classic style Pop Rocks, which consists of strawberry, watermelon, and tropical punch. Which one would you like to try? The sour ones. Which flavor would you like to try? The green apple? The blue raspberry? Or the one? Does your smell as strong as mine? It does. Well, that's a good sign. This really has a strong green apple aroma. Well, here's the pot. Quite sour as well. Let me see if it colored your tongue like it did mine. I, um, I hope you enjoyed all the samples that we tried today. Um, I hope maybe I could have introduced or even persuaded you to uh, purchase some of these amazing candies that we shared today. Oh, I 
excellent. You know exactly what you want. Well, I am very happy that I could be of assistance and help you find that perfect sweet treat to satisfy your taste buds. Oh, you are very welcome. It was a pleasure doing business with you and, and sharing some of these samples with you. Well, whenever you are ready to check out, you can meet me over there at the register. In the meantime, if you have any questions or need help finding anything else, just let me know, and I'll be more than happy to help. Okay, well, um, you take your time, and uh, I'm going to head over to the register, and I'll meet you there when you're ready.